Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lily and I'm currently participating in the Disney College program. I'm here for fall 2023, so hi. Today I thought I would give you guys a apartment tour, kind of show you guys where I'm living down here in Florida. So yeah, that's really all there is to it. Let's just get into it. So I guess before I actually show you guys the space, I will tell you guys a little bit about where I'm living. Disney actually has housing that most of the college program participants stay in. Um, called Flamingo Crossings. That's where I currently am. It's different apartment units. Uh, the different the different layouts that you could be in is a two by two. That's what I'm in, where you have two double bedrooms with two bathrooms, a four by two, which is four single bedrooms with two bathrooms, and then a four by four, which is four single bedrooms and four bathrooms. And basically you kind of like ranked in your like housing thing when you filled it out. And then it was kind of like a lottery system. You kind of get what you get and you don't get upset. So yeah, I'm in a two by two, but all the apartments, regardless of if you have um, a two by two, four by two, four by four, like bedroom wise, they all have a kitchen and a living room. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys around my little two by two. Um, I will start off out in the kitchen, living room, common space, and we will walk through and show you the entire apartment. Let's do a voiceover because I know laundry's going right now and I don't know if I can talk loud enough over the dryer. Our dryer's really loud. So this is the front door when you walk in, light switch, and then there's side B and there's side A. I'm side A. This is just a quick overview of what you're kind of working with. The kitchen and then there's a living room area. So first off, in the kitchen, you have a fridge, just a standard fridge with a freezer. Um, and then there's cabinets. They're just basic cabinets. This is my cabinet. I don't really have much in there, but that's what they look like. Then we have uh, oven, stove, microwave, um, all these cabinets, drawers, cabinets, drawers. There's a dishwasher this little island um, sink, um, under sink storage, and then there's like four high top stools to sit at this little kitchen island. And then in here is where the washer and dryer are. My clothes are drying. And then this is the living room area. We have this couch, table, um, little, TV stand, TV. Flamingo actually comes with a TV. It's a smart TV, so you can just log in to like everything and you're good to go. So like I said, I'm side A, this is my room. Um, the room opens right up to the bathroom. Hello, um, I'm wearing like pajamas, so don't mind me, but this is my side right here. Um, the double like shared bathrooms have two sides. That's my roommate's side. This is my side um, and each side has a full like three cabinets underneath. Um, underneath my sink is very chaotic, but you have plenty of space. Like I still have more space for things, but I just kind of have things sorted out into bins. And then over here, I just have a like hand towel and then like my Dyson Airwrap and my uh, what am I? Straightener, curling iron, heat tools. Um, I have this like makeup organizer here, just easier to access everything, toothbrush, and then both sides have a medicine cabinet that opens. Just have some essentials in there. Pretty self-explanatory. Then in here, this is the little like bathroom area. So there's toilet, not exciting. There's this cabinet up here where we just keep like toilet paper, extra bags for the little trash can and some cleaning supplies. And then there's the shower. Um, roommate has one side, I have the other side. I'm a little bit high maintenance, it's fine. Um, and then there's two racks for your belongings. Um, yeah, pretty cool. Uh, and like this little like nook, like toilet area, shower area locks. 
and it's separate so like someone can be in there showering go in the bathroom doing whatever then as you can see in the mirror there's a door here this is where the actual bedroom is so as you can see the room is split this is a two by two by a divider this is my roommate's side this is my side so on the door um have this thing hanging up i just have two raincoats on it this one's like a light little windbreaker this one's like a more heavy duty raincoat there's controls here um these control like the bedside lights there's a here you can see my roommates better there's a little light and then this is for the um overhead light and the ceiling fan and then moving over into my side each side comes with its own bedside table sorry the lighting's going to be weird because of the natural light but each side comes with its own little bedside table um drawers which i think these can separate and you can have them not stacked but drawers and then a closet but let me walk you through so I pushed my bed off of the divider just because I don't like making a bed up against the wall. So I pushed my bed away and I have my little table here. And I just have my laptops and whatnot at the bottom. And then my charger, medicine in the back. Just like bedside essentials. My Stanley lives there for the most part if I'm in my room. My remote control for my lights back here can change the colors of the lights which is really fun um, that's all from Amazon this little table runner is from Amazon I just cut it so I have it here and then I also have it on my dresser but we'll get to that I have that and then for my bedding beddings from Amazon silk pillowcases from Amazon body pillows from dormify I've had it for years Let's have my woody squishmallow Bryant blanket, um, Harold Build Bear, and a little Mickey plush. And then at the foot of the bed, there's this little lock box. I didn't put my lock on it yet because I don't really have anything uh, like dire in there yet. I kind of just keep junk in here, to be honest. But um, yeah, I just kind of keep junk in here. But like, I have my sunglasses, my headphones, like pens, scissors. Just like random stuff, but it's nice because you can lock it. And that just kind of like lives at the foot of the bed. And then also underneath the bed, you have tons of space. So I just keep my suitcases and duffel bags. So now moving on to this dresser area. I won't go into the drawers because it's like self-explanatory, but there's drawers that I have my clothes in. And then I have this wall that I made. I bought these frames from Marshalls and TJ Maxx, put a bunch of pictures in them. It's a mix of like Disney pictures from like movies, pictures of like from the parks, like things I like. like that's the Grand Floridian lobby, picture of me and my family on Splash Mountain. And then I have like my dog, my friends, me and my parents at my graduation, me and my roommates grad photos, you know, stuff like that. Super cute, little photo wall. Then I have table runner that I just double-sided taped down and then I like tied both sides with ribbon to make it just like look a little nicer. Um, this jewelry organizer stand thing is from Amazon. I just put my car keys on it because I didn't want to lose my car keys. Magic bands and my jewelry, my name tag. Yes, I'm still earning my ears. Perfumes. Um, and then I have my brand new Jack Skellington Nuemo I just bought, my Daisy, and then my Remy and my Forky shoulder pets. And then I just have this headband. Then I just have a bunch of random pins that I just got the other day. I underestimated how much space I had on my pin boards. I need to get another pin board. I don't have room, but these are a bunch of new pins that I have, so that's exciting. Then in this little corner, I just keep like my extra like gym bag backpack an umbrella and my um dagny dover business bag 
on the windowsill, I have two little ducks from the Duck Duck Raz drink at Boathouse at Disney Springs. Um, me and my friends went to Disney Springs last night and we got Duck Duck Razzes and we kept the rubber duckies. And we were saying we're gonna make an army, so it's funny. This is a blackout like light curtain that the previous roommate left here that I don't know what to do with, so I'm just leaving it there. Then I just have three pairs of ears hanging on the wall. These are just like ones that I really like and like the color scheme kind of matches my vibe. Um, yeah, they're just hung with command hooks. And then these are my two little pin boards. Um, yeah, I didn't realize that they were already full. I guess I could take off these. I got, I'm celebrating my program. And then I have my I'm celebrating pin from Alani, but I don't know, they're fun. But I have these, these are also from Amazon. They're mirrors and I just put cork board over it. Like I guess I can get a third and put it here. They're really cheap. Next we have the closet. Okay, um, what's really nice is the closet doors are both like full length, like door, like what, top to bottom mirrors. Um, my closet's a little chaotic right now. I have this organizer from Target that definitely helps like with keeping my things together. I have my mini ears here, but I hung them up with, uh, what's it called? Shower curtain, like rod things. I don't know, but they're getting too heavy. So I have some up there, I don't know. And then I just have my clothes. I have a bunch of laundry that is like being washed. Oof, so I have a lot of rogue hangers right now, but I just have my shoes on the ground kind of randomly and then like my hamper. It's like not the most organized, but like it works. It's just kind of a closet and then shoes. And then up here, um, I just have this hat that they gave me at Traditions. I'm gonna get it embroidered in Magic Kingdom. Get DCP 23 on it. And then this is like, a, ooh, I did not realize this light was legit pointing at my face. This is the bedside lamp that turns on with the light switch over by the door, but then there's also a little light switch right here to turn it on and off. That's pretty much the overview of the room. She's super cute. Um, I decorated, I put my own personal touch on it but I definitely will be buying more things because I think that now that I am down here, I'm probably gonna realize I need more things or I just have no self-control, but that's what my room currently looks like and I'm really happy with it. So that was my Flamingo Crossing two by two room. Um, if you liked this, be sure to give it a thumbs up, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I can't wait to keep posting my DCP adventures. Love you guys. Bye.